Well, let me tell you what happened. Still may not be much of a video today. We got here this morning. Our appointment was for two. We were early. And uh, we checked in and everything. Come to find out, they said that our appointment was for the seventh. Now, this is the sixth. So, he told me to come back. Now, tonight at 10 o'clock, hey guys, tonight at 10 o'clock, there's a, a, a snowstorm coming in. So, it's like, really? I want to get this off and kind of get out of here before the snowstorm hits, right? And I may still be in an in the area but at least I'm not going to be under any I don't know Mary may find something but right now Yankton is under a, 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 a storm right now a snowstorm so half the crew they're not even in the office so I don't know if Mary's going to be able to find me a load or not but uh, at least I'm going to get the freight on the trailer off so I don't have to worry about reefer fuel or, you know, or anything like that. I can shut the reefer off. But, uh, but I called Mary. I told Mary. Mary is our dispatcher, by the way. And I called and told her early this morning, around 7, and told her what the deal was. And uh, so she did her thing. And, uh, well, I'm in a dock. I'm in dock 45 now. So they actually... Uh, Mary did a good job. She called whoever she had to call. See, I don't know if you can see that in with this camera or not, but um, she did a good job. She called the right people, and they actually got it where I can bump the dock now. So we're in 45. I, the first clip. I thought my first clip was going to be because I was parked out there on the street. I thought I was going to be there all day until uh, seven or two o'clock in the morning. And I thought, man, what am I going to show you guys? The street? I mean, <laughs> what am I going to do, you know? But, uh, it, it may not be much of a video today, but we're going to have somewhat of a video. It's going to be fun getting out of here, that's for sure. But, uh, but anyway, we'll see what we can show you. want to thank you for writing. Don't go nowhere. Let's see what happens. I'm, I'm, I'm just as curious about this as you guys, so... We'll be right back. Well, guys, you know what? <laughs> it's not the end of the day. I know. I, I backed into a dock over here at my customer. This is on today's video. I'm not happy with this place. <laughs> you know, us as truck drivers have to keep our posture we and this is the reason why we can't lose our head this would probably just tear people apart pulling their hair out cursing yelling stomping and i'm wanting to i'm really wanting to but i i, I want to do this in a different way i use my youtube channel uh and what i mean by that is i'm going to share this with anything and everything that is out there i'm still in the dock and i still have the green light They've never started to offload me. Never started to offload me yet. Not yet. I'm still full. Uh, I don't know what time I really... Let's, let's do some investigating. First of all, um, and I, I'm not being negative. What I want to do is, I'm, I'm just letting you guys know, the ones that have to come to this place that I'm at, I'm here to tell you, you better pack a lunch. You better pack a lunch because you're going to be here for a long time. It is, let, let's get to my uh, phone. It's 9.48 p.m., okay? Now, let's go in here. I can tell you what time I actually, first of all, I got here at 2 or 1.45 yesterday afternoon. 1.45, I, I guess I could say this morning. It's the same day, okay? <clears throat> so 1.45 in the morning, this coming morning, will actually be a 24-hour being here. Now here's the deal.
let's go here and let's go here I, I'm gonna tell you uh, One thirty-three p.m. I got a phone call for them to tell me go ahead and go into the dock. One thirty-three this afternoon. Go ahead and go into the dock. Now, originally, when I first got here and I checked in, if you remember, they said, "Oh, you're early. You're supposed to be here on the seventh, right?" And supposedly, the customer that we picked up the load for. Uh, changed it now to today and uh instead of the seventh uh but i think what in it what's going to end up happening is what i think what's going to end up happening is i don't think it was really changed <clears throat> i think they put me in the dock thinking i was going to shut my mouth right but i'm still in the dock and it's going to end up being the seventh before they end up taking this load off Oh, it's 10.50. Excuse me, I was giving you guys central time. It's 10.50. And we're still here. Now, here's the Wayne Banger. There's a storm coming in. Yeah. There's a clipper coming in. And now, if I don't get out of here, first of all, there's going to be some restriction uh, in Pennsylvania. Um... Had this sent to me by Angelo, if you guys know who he is. Um, it says the Pennsylvania dot DOT uh, uh, central office has provided the following announcement. Starting at midnight on March 7th. That's only, well it's 10.51, so we're only talking about an hour and nine minutes. Uh... Any empty trucks and tandem trailer, or tractor trailer ban will go in effect until further notice. I-84 entire length, I-81 the entire length, I-380 the entire length, I-78 the entire length, I-476 between Allentown and Clark Summit, and I-80. Uh, between I-81 and the New Jersey state line beginning at 8 a.m. <coughs> March 7th a full commercial vehicle ban will be in place on the entire length of I-84 and I-380 now that's all up in Pennsylvania okay now I knew about this come noon all right I even told our dispatcher, I got to get offloaded. I, 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 I need another load. I got to get out of here because what's going to end up happening is come 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, I'm not going to be able to cross into, Jer or into Pennsylvania. It's going to be shut down. There's going to be a storm that's coming in. And let's see. Now let me go uh, in here. And I'll read this to you. Winter storm warning in effect at 10 p.m. Eastern until Tuesday at 4 a.m. Eastern. Sources U.S. National Service, Weather Service. Winter storm warning remains in effect from 10 p.m. this evening to 4 a.m. Eastern time on Thursday. What to expect? Heavy snow expected, total snow accumulation 6 to 12 inches, except 10 to, 10 to 15 inches across the interior portions of the lower Hudson Valley and most of the interior southern Connecticut. Locally, higher amounts are possible. Where? The New York City, Northeast New Jersey, and lower Hudson Valley, Southwest uh, Southwestern Connecticut, Middle Middlesex, Nasa, N A S S A U, and Northwestern Suffolk County. Uh, wind from 10 p.m. this evening to 4 a.m. Thursday morning. 
Now, I'd be damned if I'm going to be stuck on a street because there's no truck stop here. All right? I may have to go to the service plug. But this this is another thing that I'm going to be running into. It's late. Where am I going to park? So you got to park before places get full. And if the snow comes and I'm still here, you know where I'm going to end up being is out there on the street. That's the only place I'm going to be able to park. And that's where we're going to be snowed in. And it's all because the shipper didn't... 6 a.m. Mary said, be here by 6 a.m. on the 6th. Or 2 a.m., I'm sorry. 2 a.m. on the 6th. We were. And here it's going to be the next day. I'm going to be in the middle of this. Let's see. That's no facilities. I got food in here. I don't know how long I can... Uh, how long my food will actually last me but we do have food in a truck <coughs> but there's no facilities I guess we'll have to do it just like the cavemen well the liquid is coming down but it's not coming down as snow right now I don't think it's that cold but it is starting to rain and we're cooking us a hamburger and some uh, sliced carrots. That's what we're going to have tonight. Not very much, but you know, it's food. Yeah. Well, we're going to cook this hamburger. We're still in the dock. Still have our green light. Never got a red light yet. Never felt no bouncing. And it's. Are you ready for this? I don't know if that's right or not. 2.15 in the morning. So actually, when they said my appointment was for the 7th, and the company called and did their thing, I mean, they did. And told me I can go ahead and they're going to offload me early. This place where I'm at did not think they were going to do that. So they actually literally kept me until after 2 their time. They still haven't started. We're still waiting. We're going to see how long it takes them to actually offload us. Meanwhile, we'll continue cooking the hamburger. We'll be right back. And there it is, guys. A cheeseburger, my carrots, a cherry coke. We're still in a dock, but we're still eating. We'll be right back. Wow. Anyway, we're in the dock. See there? Yep. And they're finally 2.57 in the morning, we're getting offloaded on the 7th. So it's over 24 hours since I've been here. And it is snowing, definitely snowing. So we're gonna try to still get out of here. I'll keep you up and I'll be right back. Uh, when I, let's say 4 uh, a.m. on the 6th, let's say it took them only two hours to offload me. Okay, our dispatcher gets there at 7 a.m. Eastern or not Eastern but Central time which is 8 they could have set me up with another load I lost a whole entire day a whole entire day and I'm still in a dock something's got to change and I'm going to share this I, I, and I'm hoping it goes viral this is the truth the ugly truth of trucking this is the ugly, ugly truth. And and on top of that, guys, I'm not I don't get paid hourly. I'm not getting paid nothing as far as I know. Cause I I, I asked and it's went on death ears. It it actually went right through somebody somebody's ears into the and I can't get a a, a correct answer on this. Roar.
anybody. I was in the last dock. I finally got a green light. The last one, 47 or something like that. You guys hit the Guinness Book of Records. It's gonna be fun, man. They guy said, "How long you been here?" And I told him. Didn't they change? But they said the seventh. I said, "Yeah," but they changed it. 1:30. I was in that dock. Oh, you was. They didn't even start on me until the seventh. Oh, you're a good man. Thank you, sir. You, you betcha.